I don't want to stay here any longer than we have to, so let's just pick an approach and stick to it, okay? Just humor me. Oh, okay, well, I didn't... Let's just keep our focus on questioning Lawrence. Where she was, who she was with, that sort of thing. Well, I was going to say that, but I waited too long. I was going to press Y. Let's go. Doors open, huh? Can you hear me? Going in. Damn, all right, well, he's not answering any of our questions. Oh my god. He's alive? Go get Dr. Swinehart. I'll stay with no. you. No, no. Let me go. She. What is it that you're telling us? Bigby, water, kitchen. I'm going, I'm going. Can't go that way. This way. Come on, Bigby. What was a note? What's this say? Pay the rent next week. Pizza in the fridge. Please don't look for me. Did you find Goodbye. It yet? Huh. I'm going. Look at that face. If you have something to ask him, I should do it now. Am I only going to get like one question now? Who did this to you? Do you still have that letter? Yes. It's only two words, but he died without seeing them. I'm sorry. We need to figure out what happened here and find whoever did this. More investigation. Got another entry as well. I'm really liking this game. I'm just. This is only one episode. What the hell? This has been really fun. Prince Lawrence, Faith's husband. After escaping the homelands, Prince Lawrence and his wife, Faith, immediately fell victim to the harsh realities of the mundane world. They moved to New York, hoping to find aid in a community of fellow fables. But without enough money to live in Fable Town, they had to settle on an apartment on the outskirts of the neighborhood. Unfortunately, that meant that they were out of sight and out of mind when it came to government assistance. Their prospects dwindling, Faith left Lawrence to try to make it on her own. Now, without his wife for support, Lawrence struggles to motivate himself and quickly sinks into depression. And now he's dead, so... That's great. He did, and Faith did it, apparently. When do you think that was taken? Before all this... Faith did it apparently. Still a little sticky. That's not blood. Ho oh, oh. ho! I'll stop. Right, before we check that door. The mirror showed me this. Maybe 
I should have come here first. It's sharp. There's blood on the blade. I just don't understand. Why would someone want to kill him? I don't know, but we'll find out. We'll find out. Fingerprints? They'll be on the grip and the trigger. What's this? Is the caliber of the gun on the floor. So he was shot in the head. But what why was the knife then? Prescription sleeping pills. Anything else? Alright. Let's check what's going on with this door. Oh, it's a bed. Son of a... It's stuck to the bed a little. Oh, hold up. My dearest Faith, I never meant to hurt you, and I cannot endure knowing that I have. This was for the best, and I'll see you again. Love, your devoted Lawrence. Hopefully they're together now. About all we can hope for at this point. Man, this is like a mystery within a mystery. Oh, bullet hole. But did he shoot himself? That is the question. Is there nothing else over here? Oh, the fan. That doesn't really help. Oh, my bad. Sorry. Do you want the fan back on? My apologies. Jesus. Um, that seems to be everything. What are we missing here? Can we watch TV? Probably go in the kitchen again. Oh, hang on. Dusty. No one's read these in a while. Secondhand paperbacks. Old encyclopedias. And then why is she looking in there, man? Can you do something useful? Oh my god! Stay here! No! Stop! Leave me alone! Not gonna lie, that got me. Oh! Damn, man! Take a chill pill. Come on, Big B. Oh, this one, obviously. What? He almost gave you the slip. Oh, did he go on the other door? Oh, he almost got away, huh? Not on my watch, though. Oh! Oh, LT! It's usually RT, that old man. They're really trying. Hey! Ease up, Big B. We're on the same side here. You son of a bitch. Make me 
run after you. Who are you? <sighs> what? Who are you? Listen, man. I'm a private investigator. A man's dead. I know how it looks, but I had nothing to do with that. Bullshit. You're covered in blood. Look, I was just asking him about the girl. That's all. When I mentioned her being dead, he freaked out. I figured someone had told him. How was I supposed to know? Shit. Fucker shot himself right in front of me. I couldn't stop him, man. You're looking for the woodsman, right? I know where he is. My guy says he's holed up at the trip trap. We can go over there right now, the both of us. My employer's looking to ask him a few questions, too. Who's your employer? I can't tell you that. It's confidential. Sorry. Sure you understand? Nope. Can't say that I do. Come on. You're coming with me. This could have been easy. Huh. Don't worry. It still is. Come on. Dumb. Dumb? Yeah, it is. Look, it'd be much easier for you no, to... No, I'm D. He's dumb. He almost looked peaceful. Yep. Except you're lying in a dirty alley. Yep. With an open wound on the back of your head. Yep. Where'd they go? Well, after the one guy hit you, and the other one finished kicking you... That explains the ribs. Then they jumped into a car and drove off. Come on, get up. Guess we're out of options. D mentioned the trip trap. Then that's where we'll go. I'll call a cab. Every time I think I'm getting a handle on what's going on, things just get more complicated. It feels like we're always a step behind. The woodsman is the only lead we've got, and he was one of the last people to see Faith alive. Getting some answers out of him will start to clear things up. I hope you're right. I saw if he wants to go for round Thank two. You. Be honest with me. Who do you think did this? I know it's still early, but I just feel a step behind. Um, it's an uncomfortable feeling. Bluebeard. We haven't talked to him yet, but uh, tell me, I don't think anything would surprise me at this point. I feel like Bluebeard has something to do with this. I had the same suspicion. I don't know how or why just yet, but if you're asking, this is his M.O. There's still a lot of questions. We find the woodsman, figure out what he knows. And go from there. And we're looking at his file that's on the desk. Like, that's probably the best. Approach. How convenient is that? It has to be him. He has to be part of this. We w they wouldn't just make us look at his file like that. He wasn't part of this, unless that's what they want us to think. Thanks I for wish you. there was. Oh. Sorry. Go ahead. I didn't mean to cut you off. No, it's... It's nothing. I just... The sexual tension, man. Seeing all this today, there are fables that are struggling worse than I'd imagined. We pay so much attention to the residents of the woodlands. You forget there's a whole community out there to serve. To have to turn to prostitution. I, I wish there was more we could do. This isn't how I thought it would be. But Crane runs things his own way. You're doing your best. It's all anyone can do. Obviously, you don't know what I do all day. Right now, I'm the gatekeeper, making sure none of these disenfranchised folks are, as he puts it, 
wasting his time. You'll fix it. Damn, I should appreciate it, Pat. I'm a smooth talker. System. The fables who walk in through the back door like Bluebeard, we have all the time in the world for them. You try and come in through the front door, through the proper channels, asking for anything, needing help. Well, I turn you away. Now things are worse off than they've ever been. Well, that's not true. Right. We've had it worse, but not by much. Maybe this isn't for me. I thought public service was pure. You should stick it out. There are fables that would give up a lot to be in the position you're in, and I think it's easier to change something from the inside. You're telling me change comes from within. Uh, sure. Not the advice I imagined hearing from you. Yeah, it's because I'm full of surprises. I'm, I'm the one pulling the strings behind him. Trip trap. We're here. Maybe you should handle this one. Yeah, maybe I should. Big B. Be careful. I. Um, yeah. Just be careful. I can read your mind. Same goes for you. I will. Oh, what did she just say, huh? Was she just talking shit? Wait, wasn't something going on in the alley? 